My oak is full of these strange growths, their galls, and the topic of our two-minute pest. Tom, do you have ever, ever get these on your oak trees? I know oaks are full of it. Well, it gets more galls than any other plant, I think. And it does. There's lots of them. Here's some right here also. Now, now, some of them are mystery galls. You know, we're not quite, totally sure what they all are, but look where you see this type of growth there. It looks like there was a wound there at one time, do you think? And, and all it would take would be a bacteria to get in there and cause these galling type growths, but that's just one type. Now, up here is an insect gall. We know that. I think that's called gouty gall or something. They all have names, but there's so many galls out now. It may just be oak gall, round oak gall, or something of that nature. What and, do you got and there? And how, how do galls occur, actually? Well, a couple of ways. The insect gall. Yeah, insect galls can be mites, it can be aphids, it can be uh, wasps that get in there. They lay the eggs into the stem tissue, and then the stem uh, produces kind of a, a cancerous growth. And then there's a little insect that lives in that area, matures in there, larva stage, and eventually it comes out. And you have another one. Yeah, there, one there's here, a good one there. It yeah. came off the same plant, but yeah. here the insect hasn't emerged yet. Isn't that so something? If we opened that, we probably would see the eggs yeah, or the developing inside. insect. But, but isn't that amazing that the plant can do that and uh, the, the insect can stimulate it to do it? Kind of a cancerous-like growth. It's really kind of neat there. So unfortunately, though, when people see them, it's, it's scary. shocking and scary. scary. Yeah. And tell me, is it going to kill the tree? Uh, normally it doesn't kill the tree. Now this one here, you're probably going to get maybe some more rot down in there. So it can be a problem for the tree, but it's not going to kill the tree. Now I've got another neat one here. We want to show people this one. This is one called leafy gall. Isn't that kind of neat there, where a gall produces something that looks like a leaf, and sometime the tree will be full of those. It almost looks like it's supposed to be yeah, there. Yeah, paint them red. Kind of cute. Well, Tom, what do we do with galls? We ignore them. We ignore them. <laughs> so it's one of those, galls are one of those grin and bear it organisms that just occur, and oaks get them more than any other plant.